Music legend Dionne Warwick was in Prince George's County today for the dedication of a college theater in her name. And it'll offer inspiration for generations of performers and patrons of the arts. News Force Derek Ward. With that, the main stage at Bowie State University's Fine and Performing Arts Center was dedicated to a music legend. Dionne Warwick was at the campus today for the dedication and a tribute to her body of work spanning almost 70 years. Bowie State students performed several interpretations of her music, songs that charted before they were born given new life by a new generation. Radio personality Joe Madison and News Force Tracy Wilkins emceed the event. There's one of those six degrees of separation connections with the campus via former Bowie State faculty member Dr. Clarence Knight, a professional musician. When she was at the Carter Baron, I was in the band playing behind Dion. When she was in Baltimore with that big orchestra, I was in the orchestra behind Dion. He was instrumental in getting this theater built and one of the drivers in getting her name on it. Vice President for Philanthropic Engagement Brent Swinton says a visit to the campus sealed it for Warwick. She wanted to contribute something to Maryland's oldest historic black college. We still were able to have her uh, have the idea and the discussion about which part of the university she'd like to have her name on and we settled on the main stage theater. Chair of Fine and Performing Arts Teodris Williams says it'll help draw more performers and provide inspiration to students regardless of their major. Not only about her music but about her style you know uh, we teach fashion design I said you're just a fly lady Miss Warwick so let's talk about your style. And seeing a name like this really gives us another extra boost of pride uh, to be able to come and perform in a space that's so amazing. I say a little prayer for you and performing the music of an icon in front of that icon? Just the opportunity alone it is amazing. No one was more amazed than Warwick herself. I am thrilled about it. I am um, completely overwhelmed, um, exceptionally proud, and um, I'm looking forward to whatever it is that they feel I can bring to it. In Bowie, Derek Ward, News 4. I gotta say, it's, it's overwhelming. And earlier this week, check this out. News 4's Mark Seagrave sat that, down um, with the music icon ahead of today's ceremony. You can watch that full interview in the NBC Washington app. Just use the search term Dion Warwick.